Oh man, look at that. We're already back. This. Oh shit. It's been months again, hasn't it? Yep. Okay, so Pi Day. I've decided that I am going to upgrade my Media Center PC that I built a few years back. This thing was built with an old, like, all in one board, Atom processor type of thing. Ran an old Linux install that had uh, Kodi built into it. Ran great for a while. But over the years, it's just, it's kind of fallen out of favor. The machine was getting slow. So I decided that with as powerful as the Raspberry Pi is now, I'm gonna go ahead and take a Raspberry Pi and I'm gonna put it in this picture frame. And that picture frame was designed for a much larger board than what we've got here with the Raspberry Pi. You can see it here. This frame is going to be way oversized for what this Raspberry Pi is. But it's gonna look good because we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put in some new lights into it. We're gonna take out the old black light tube lights that were in the original build and we're gonna put in full controllable LEDs that are actually going to light up inside this thing and with all this extra space that's around this Raspberry Pi This thing is going to look amazing little power distribution board We have our barrel plug. It's going to bring in our main 5 volt line From there we have that split out So that's going to go to the LED strip that's going to be inside the case powering the Wemo D1 Mini and then we also have a line run to this USB breakout and there's obviously no data connections connected, but we have the power and ground, and that's going to allow us to be able to feed the five volts to the Raspberry Pi and go through the voltage regulator the normal way through the USB plug. So the lighting turned out way better than I expected it to. The front cover on the inside of the first frame and then the backing on the second frame all being white, it allowed that light to bounce around in there way better than I expected it to. Uh, there's 64 total LEDs in there, but it's hard to see the individual light. All of it seems to be very diffused. Everything is very nice and soft. And even on camera, the camera doesn't even do the do it justice. So what we're using to control that is actually a project called WLED. It's from a, uh, a developer named Air Cookie. Uh, fantastic name, by the way. So that's going to end this one. Um, happy Pi Day. Um, hopefully we get it. We're getting some new news with uh, some new Raspberry Pi stuff. I can't imagine that a Raspberry Pi 5 is out yet, but who knows? Um, by the time we you know, this is actually posted, we might have a new Raspberry Pi out there. Um, so happy Pi Day. And you know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. Thanks.